wanted you to shoot those threes. That was it. I mean, that was it. Had the rhythm going. And that pass that Scott had where he was uh, passing it behind you and then you just took yeah. it from there. So yeah, I had to run and start so it was easy to finish that one. So it wasn't just three-pointers, it was slam dunks as well. Yeah, yeah. So that was good. So it feels, does it feel good getting this win after uh, losing to the Clippers on a controversial play last week? Yeah, finished the year on a good note and then we go on the road now and try to uh, get a couple dubs. Well, congratulations. It's a great game. I'm very excited to watch it. Thank you. All right, thanks. Yeah, thank you. Scott, you turned this game on fire from the beginning. You scored, was it, seven points to start the game. You had the behind-the-back pass, Travis. You were feeling it tonight. Yeah, um, I was. Um, a lot of the coaches were trying to tell me to get back to my old ways and kind of just continue to push for what I'm out here for. Um, I'm trying to get back into the NBA. And just to show we're trying to separate myself from a lot of players. So today I just came out with a little bit of fire. Double double on the was eleven assists. Yeah, yeah. Usually um, you don't get people don't get double doubles with assists. It's usually rebounds, but yeah. you got it with assists. So you were sharing the ball and scoring. Yeah, um, I got to thank my teammates for the assists for sure. Um, being in the right spots at the right time and just trying to make the right plays. So in your head, do you think to yourself, okay, who has the hot hand right now? So just keep feeding Travis. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. You, mean you gotta, you gotta find the shooters. You gotta find who's making shots at the time. And that's really what it is. Yeah, Beecham came up at the end and started shooting some threes. Absolutely, absolutely. Um, a lot of my teammates are playing to the best of their abilities right now, and we can only get better as a team. So we're just trying to grow. So did you get over the heartbreak of the other night uh, uh, and still, that controversial it's, it's, play? It's still a little itching. It's still and stinging I, yeah, you a little. Yeah, for sure. But um, we're I mean, we're happy that we got a win for the New Year's. Just trying to get into the next one. Well, happy New Year's and congratulations. Thank you. Happy New Year's to you too. Thank okay. you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Coach Carl, I six players in double figures, two with double doubles. Um, it was a prolific game. Was it a fun game to coach? Yeah, no, we did have fun. Uh, you know, some really, really good passes by our guards, and, and we got to the and had some big time finishes. A lot of extra, extra giving up good shots for great ones. So uh, overall, and, and we had you know, everyone got on the floor, and everyone, basically everyone other than Mike was able to really contribute. Yeah, that was, uh, we heard the chance from the crowds trying to get some of the players in who hadn't been playing very much. But you did get close. I mean, you got, got to eight points at what point. Um, but it seemed like the players pulled it out. Yeah, no, they responded well. We had a, we had a lapse in the second quarter. We had a lapse in the third quarter, but uh, they responded well. Our bench came in and really produced in the start the fourth and in the third. So it uh, really helped us out. And Scotty started out <laughs> on fire. I think he got everybody going. Yeah, Scotty does that for us. You know, his ability to change the pace is as good as anyone. He, he can get to the ball and forth. You know, he, he does a lot for us. You know, with fan base. It was good to see him start us off aggressively. You've had a merry-go-round in the last three or four games, haven't you? Zubats and Thomas. Only Thomas. Only Zubats. Is it harder this season, you think, or is it is it just the same? Uh, I mean, it has some difficulties, but it's it's good. It's, it's fun for, for us as a staff to learn, and myself to learn. Different uh, styles yeah, and lineups. You know, and figuring it out and, and trying to put ourselves in a situation to win. So it does provide some difficulties, but um, you know, our guys are, are really resilient. And so, uh, that's all you can do. And um, I was at the last game as well at the Clippers, and it would it really looked like goaltending to me. So. Do you want to comment at all on that, or do you want to just let that pass? It was unfortunate. I mean, extremely unfortunate. Our guys really fought hard. Um, I mean, there's a lot about that situation that uh, upsets me. Mm -hmm. you know, we don't get, they don't get that. I trust that the referees are doing their, their, their best to their knowledge, but uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's really shitty when, when uh, the team that was supposed to win doesn't win really because of that. So. Right, when the referee actually makes the game won or lost, it just makes that They got escorted out. Yeah. I saw that. So. It makes an emotional game. All of us are here and it's our livelihood. We care a lot about it. So.
to suffer that. Well, chip on your shoulder for the next game. I think you guys need to take the next two to even it up, right? Yeah, hopefully. All right, congrats on this win. It was Thank a great you. win. Really fun.